Walmart pays its employees wages that are so low that many of their employees are forced to go on food stamps and Medicaid. Now here is what is absurd. The middle class and working class of this country pay higher taxes in order to subsidize the workers of Walmart who work for the wealthiest family in the United States of America. See, that is, that's a rigged economy. Working people should not have to subsidize a family worth $130 billion. You know, you got a lot of Republicans talking about people on welfare ripping off the system. It turns out that the Walton family is the major beneficiary of welfare in the United States of America. Billions of dollars, actually. We give their family billions of dollars to subsidize their employees. So I say to the Walton family, those of you who work in Walmart, you can convey, convey this to the family. They've got to start paying their workers a living wage. We're tired of subsidizing them. And then just to kind of complete the circle here, it turns out that one of the Waltons, Alice Walton, makes a $300,000 campaign contribution to Secretary Clinton's PAC, Super PAC. So maybe instead of contributing hundreds of thousands of dollars to Secretary Clinton's super fact, she might want to use that money to pay her workers a living wage. <laughs> 